Hey everybody, thank you for checking out View Golf. Today we're gonna do a what's in the bag edition. Um, this is Trent here. I'm gonna go through what's in my bag for 2017. We did a 2016 version. I've got a couple new clubs in there and uh, we'll talk about those. We're gonna start here with the wedge. Every club in my bag is one degree flat and I play a Project X 6.0 uh, shaft. So here you are, I've got the Moki SM6. This is about a year old. And as you can tell, I've done a little bit of chipping with it, but uh, the new SM6 wedge has uh, a finish on it that allows for double the lifespan of a wedge. So I'll probably continue playing this through this year. I've got an M grind. I've got a little heel and toe relief. Um, that lets me play it from an open place position. I, I use it a lot around the greens. I chip with it, pitch with it, lob with it. So I kind of like having that M grind. Um, to give me that uh, variability from, from uh, that open face position. I do have a customization here um, with my daughter's name on it, so I really like that. Uh, my 56, it has 10 degrees bounce on it. It is an S grind. I play that a little bit more. Um, as a standard grind, I play it from a uh, straight forward uh, face position. Hit full shots with it. And uh, same one degree flat. Um, I do have on all my clubs, I like to keep all the grips the same. Um, and I have a Vokey Tour Velvet grip on that. I have Tour Velvet grips all the way through the golf bag. Standard size with one wrap of tape. All right, onward. 52 degree wedge. Right here, I've got, I've got the SM6. 52 F grind to play this from a straightforward position and uh, I use it a lot. Got a big gap between my sand wedge and my pitching wedge so I've carried a gap wedge in my bag for, for a number of years and I like it. Pitching wedge all the way through 4 iron. You'll catch me swinging the AP2 iron. Again Project X shaft 716 Titleist newest iron. They're due to release a new iron here uh, in the fall. So I am looking forward to that. Um, this year I've uh, switched. I used to play the uh, CBMB combo by Titleist and uh, don't get to pr practice quite as much as I used to. And I went to something a little bit more forgiving. I can definitely feel it and notice uh, when I miss hit shots, uh, especially with those long irons, I get a little bit more distance and um, the shots go a little bit straighter with these irons. So I'm liking that a lot. I do play a driving iron. I play a lot of golf in the wind being here, uh, being from Kansas. So I have a 712U, it's a three iron and uh, it's a great club if you wanna kinda of hit a low spinning. For me, it's about a 220 to 240 shot. Um, I can get it high, but uh, I really can hit it low and that's something I don't, uh, I can't do generally with a hybrid. So I play this club a lot just, uh, and play it off the tee and off the ground. Uh, going on to the fairway woods, I play Titleist 917 F3 fairway wood, standard setting, um, 15 degrees loft, um, it's fantastic. I played the 915 fairway woods uh, two year and a half, two years ago. I like that, but I like this a little bit more. I've noticed a little bit lower spinning. I, it goes a, maybe 10 or 15 yards further off the tee box. Um, because of that, but yet I can still get it in there pretty good um, if I need to hit kind of a high cut into the par fives, but I use it off the tee and love it. Shaft, you are gonna be looking at a Diamana 80 gram stiff shaft. I've been playing stiff the last uh, year and a half since I switched to these 917s. I was in an X stiff um, and just don't swing it quite as fast as I used to could. So I am It said it's search the SureFit CG set it standard. I haven't done anything with that to, to change the ball flight. Um, my driver is the 917 D3, nine and a half degrees loft, standards A1 setting. Uh, SureFit CG is in the standard um, position. Haven't done anything there, really like it. Feel like it's a pretty low spinning driver. Um, and very, very forgiving. And that's probably the number one reason why I play this driver. Okay. 
Let's get this flipped upside down. There you go, Diamana. 70 grams stiff flex again. Like I said, I went to stiff flex about a year, year and a half ago. Um, it's just easier for me to swing and uh, not create quite as much speed as I used to, and especially in colder weather. So there you go. Finally, my putter. I play a Scotty Cameron Futura X5R. Um, 10 gram weights in the heel and toe. I haven't done anything with that. This putter is completely custom or completely stock. Um, 10, uh, it's 35 inches long and probably four or five degrees loft on it. So um, I like this putter a lot. The grip is the same. Scotty Cameron, obviously a little worn. Uh, I'm not a big grip changer. I kind of like to keep the grips um, as long as I can, even when my hands kind of tend to wear a hole in them. I just, that's just me. So again, thanks for checking our video out. I appreciate it. We appreciate it. And uh, if you liked it, make sure you click like below or subscribe to your page or to our page. Um, or uh, if you have any comments, you want to see any new material, let us know. Thanks a lot.